Hey, welcome back to the Pokemon Project. My name is Joel Wilduke, and I am your host today, and we are going to be opening up some more Sword and Shield Booster Packs. So here we go. Today is uh, Easter Sunday. I hope you guys had a wonderful Easter. Happy Easter. I know you're watching this on Friday, and for some reason I can't crack this pack. But uh, I hope you guys had a wonderful Easter, even though we're all still stuck inside from the quarantine of the coronavirus. One, two, three, four. We're gonna guest uh, lightning energy. Oh, high five! First one. It's like the first one in a long time that uh, I was able to get. But um, no, we had a wonderful Easter. See, the kids woke up. Uh, they let me and my wife sleep in. Thank you, Jesus. Uh, and and we we woke up. We did the Easter baskets for the kids. Again, we have four kids. Um, each of them got a different, uh, like, we, we did we do like buckets with candy and like toys. So my older kids got some Bakugans, my younger kids got like an Anadol, and uh, Seth is like, he loves cars and trucks. And so he got him a whole pack of cars and trucks. And so he was just a happy kid. He just kept saying, Dad, thank you. This is what I've always wanted. He's always wanted a water energy. Ooh, leaf. But uh, no, we had a lot of fun. So we had church this morning. Uh, we have church online as always. You can check us out by going to uh, uh, www.facebook forward slash station, I'll say stationhornell.com or fa I probably just got wrong. You know what? Don't listen to my words. Look underneath here and we'll make sure you get the correct link. Also, I can link our church's uh, YouTube channel so we just launched that this week as well. We got air balloon and a marsh na not hello rare. So we are on the search for anything gold. We opened up the gold quick ball last week and that was an amazing video or uh, two weeks ago. It's, that was an amazing video. You can go back and check that out or uh, finish this video. It should be right in the eye uh, up here or over here um, at the end of this video. I'll make sure you guys go ahead and check that out. Uh, that was a fun video. Last week I did Hidden Fates with my son Matthew, and we're gonna go with Fighting Energy. Ooh, dark. Uh, but hey, how was your guys' Easter? Go ahead and put in the comments below. Um, as you guys may know, I am a pastor, and Easter is like the Christian Super Bowl. All right, it is the best day of the year because that is where our hope is. You know, many of you guys know that life here on Earth is sometimes can be very difficult. Uh, there's hopelessness, we have stress, worries, fears, and like that, but uh, the Bible that I read tells me that God is our hope, and we are uh, in his hands, and he can take care of us. He loves us so much that he sent his one and only son, Jesus, to this world uh, to take away all those pains and fears. We're going to go with water energy, steel, and uh, he took my place so that I can live forever with him. And so that is my hope. Uh, but go ahead and check out our Facebook, our YouTube, and you can learn a little bit more about Station Church and who we are and what we're doing. Um, but we just launched uh, YouTube. And it's also, we're celebrating not only Easter, but our one year anniversary as Station Church. And so it's been really cool. But uh, Sword and Shield, man. I am hoping to get some more really nice uh, cards. I haven't opened up a hyper rare in a while. Hopefully we get something tonight, uh, which is very good. I, I know I'm shooting at like 1030 at night here in my city of Cornell. Um, but I have friends that are sending me pictures of the golden Zashin and Zaman Zenta. And it's like, guys, I can't get it. The best thing I've got so far is a quick ball and a fire energy. Ooh, psychic. So if you guys have some awesome pulls, go ahead and put it in uh, the comments below. Tell me what you've opened in Sword and Shield. Um, but I'm excited about the new set coming out, uh, Rebel Clash. Hopefully it will come out when it's supposed to, but guessing that Pokemon cars are not essential right now. We'll probably push it back uh, about a month uh, before we get to see any of those. We got a Muna, Reverse, Hollow, and a Chromanaut. Nothing yet, we get about half the packets through. But uh, if you're liking the Pokemon Project and you, I mean, this is our 10th episode, which is amazing, by the way. Um, go ahead and like, comment, 
uh, hit that thumbs up. We would, let's see if we can't get 10 thumbs up for this video um, and help us continue to grow the family. We're gonna go with Leaf Energy, Fire. I guess Fire last time, we should have we done that. Uh, hop, Dotler, Marcus, Mudbury, Ponandard, Score Bunny. We got a Nicket, a Reverse Rose Raid, and ooh, look at that Hollow Rare Bolton. I don't think I've gotten him yet. Um, next time we do Sword and Shield, we'll also do a a binder update so that way you guys can go ahead and see where we're at, what we've collected so far, um, and then. You can let me know how you're doing on your binder and see what kind of cards we need. I mean, I know I need a ton of different V cards. I need all the hyper rares. Um, I don't think I have a single hyper rare yet. I do have the Snorlax V Max, but that is it. You know, everything else I'm kind of uh, missing so far. So we'll kind of see. Um, next week, I am hoping to do a video with Brittany. So if you'd like to see her in a video, go ahead and comment below and say, Brittany, Brittany, we want leaf energy, water. We got the Wacky, the Lucky Egg, Double, Krogunk, Galarian Meow, Score Bunny, Sinista, Marctus, we got a Reverse, Rare, and, ooh, look at that, we got a Cinderace. I know we don't have a Cinderace. Cinderace Holographic, awesome card. Look at the shininess in that. Very cool. But, uh,. Yeah, this uh, quarantine thing, man. I'm hoping it's not lasting too much longer. Um, looking at just the statistics, we are here in New York, not just the number one in cases and deaths in the United States, but almost in the entire world. And uh, it's been insane out there. So I'm, I'm, I'm praying that you guys are staying safe, staying healthy, and uh, everybody's doing good. We're gonna go with water energy, fighting, so what are you doing to stay busy? That's my question. Is what are you guys doing out there to keep yourselves busy, keeping your minds off from everything going on? Um, are you guys taking extra precautions? Are you doing anything fun? So some of the fun things that we've been doing with our kids is like on the windows, uh, maybe I'll, I'll put a picture somewhere, maybe at the end of this video. Um, we've been doing like flower cutouts and they do little projects and we stick them in the window, we paint in the windows got rainbows in there just talking about hope and we got oh look at that we got a snorlax v full art is it a hyper rare i don't know it's definitely awesome look at that i know i do not have this i'm actually gonna put this in a sleeve right now but uh yeah i've got a friend who keeps sending me pictures of all the amazing cards they're opening up if you guys some amazing polls you can even go to our facebook page uh the pokemon project and send your pictures to us. I'll put a link again down here. Check us out on Facebook. Go there. It'd be awesome to uh, have you part of the family there. And I need to learn how to open up packs for sure. What a nice Snorlax. So I can, I know that I have the Snorlax V. Now I have the Full Art V. And I have the V Max. Now I only need the Hyper Rare which would be amazing that I have all the Snorlaxes. We're gonna go with Fighting Energy, Fire, that Air Balloon, Pelpad, Kingler, Goldeen, Rosilia, Ghastly, Bernard, I'm gonna call him the Slug. We've got a Reverse Hollow Krabby and a Dreadnought. Now we're gonna put these rares right up here i probably should sleeve them too because we definitely need them sleeved for our binder i did get some of the uh uh sword and shield tins and so those will be coming up on the channel very soon um one of the things not only are we trying to collect them all when it comes to the set but i also want to collect all the promos for sword and shield from the very first number one all the way through the very last one which probably won't come out from for another three to four years. And so that is going to be um, a task that is worth taking, okay? Uh, I know that Sun and Moon has just ended. They just pulled out some of their last promos. And uh, 
man, some of those promos are just amazing and they do hold their value through the years. And so if you can get your hands on those and you know, 10, 20 years from now, you know, they're, yes, today they're worth $1, $2, $5, $5, but 10, 20 years from now, they're gonna be, you know, $50. And uh, you can put your kid into college for that. Ready, we're gonna go with water. Ooh, now they're fighting. So we have Pokemon 3.0, Egos, Snome, Little Grookey, Shelter, Mawile, My Little Pony. Isn't she so cute? We're gonna reverse Meowth and, ooh, I do not believe I got a Marnie. So this is my, I think this is my very first Marnie, or at least it's my first hollow rare Marnie. So we're gonna put her in a sleeve. It'd be great to get a hyper rare at the same time. Can you imagine that? I'd probably really jump up and go, woo woo. I don't know if you guys noticed, like, look, I think I'm gonna, I tried putting a shelf out here. Um, it just didn't work out with my setup. I'm, I'm literally like, I'm touching the wall. And so I'm very close to the wall. And so I have a stool. I've got the Ultra Ball, Hidden Fates, Premium Collection, and I've got the Great Ball out here with the Elite Trainer Box. Remember, Hidden Fates has gone through the roof when it comes to value. So Elite Trainer Box first came out at $49.99, and you can get that just about anywhere. So right now, the only place you can get it is from a local game store or like something like eBay. And they're going for over $125 to $150 depending on uh, the seller, okay? And so you wanna talk about going up in value? That is up in value. These guys here uh, came out at $59.99. I went to GameStop and I got one of those 25% off promotionals. And so I've got them much cheaper um, but right now they're going about $70 a piece. So $100 at opening, now it's $150. It's, it's crazy. And so if you had the opportunity to collect boxes, it's great. So each week I'm gonna pull out some different boxes, show you my hidden fake collection little by little, and uh, it'll be fun. And I think I'll just kind of keep that up with all the other things that I'm collecting, like um, Flash Fire on some of the XY series and uh, my base, packs and my sword and shield stuff. So we're gonna go with lightning. Oh, high five, second one, first and last. Amazing. This is last pack magic. So what are we gonna guess? Go ahead and type in the, the comments below. What do you think the last card is going to be? I'm gonna say it's going to be, I don't know, I'm hoping for, you know, let's hope for that, that Snorlax hyper rare and see if we can get the Snorlax finished out. We got Yamper, Plobos, Cottony, Tweedle, Rhyhorn, we got a Reverse Hollow, Machino, and a Rallaboom. Non-holographic, I know I have him. So I'm gonna go ahead and take these cards, go through my binder and see what I'm missing, add them to the binder, and the next time we do Sword and Shield, we are going to take a look at the Sword and Shield binder and show you what we have and kind of figure out what we still need. But as always, family, thank you for watching the Pokemon Project. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit the thumbs up. We're trying to get 20 thumbs up, 10 thumbs up, 15 thumbs up, 20 thumbs up. So you gotta hit that thing. Hit the notification bell. That way, every time a new video comes out, you can go ahead and watch the new video. But as always, May your life be filled with hope, love, and joy. We'll see you next time here on the Pokemon Project. Ready? Uh, uh, do something weird. Do something weird.